Jerry, where are you? You're at the beach, Jerry. Yes, you're at the beach. Okay, so I've come to Dolls Point, which is uh, Lady Robinson's beach. Jerry. Uh, I'm going to take some photos. Might do some long exposure. Jerry. But, uh... This, uh... Yeah. Jerry, look. He's happy. <laughs> Jerry's happy. It's, uh... Come on, Jerry. You be careful here. You go under. Under the bridge, Jerry. Under the bridge. Uh, anyway, uh, um, Jerry, Jerry's cancer came back. Jerry, look, the water. Yeah, the bloody. She's had diarrhea. So I went to the doctor and this fucking bullshit. What can you do? If you don't know, if you haven't watched the channel much, if you don't know already, uh, Jerry had uh, a tumour taken out of her intestine about two years ago. And that was good, yeah, that was easy. I mean, it wasn't easy, but... Jerry, huh? you were all better, weren't you? <laughs> Jerry, you always loving. And uh, it, um, that was good, because it, it cleared the obstruction, and she was throwing up and everything. So anyway, it's been two years, and I noticed uh, a lot of diarrhea every like all the time not all the time anyway they did a bloody ultrasound and there's uh there's growth in the uh in the small intestine where it meets the colon i think they call it the ileum <coughs> and uh jerry look how beautiful the water is Hey, look how beautiful it is, Jerry. <laughs> yes, Jerry loves it. Look at the ducks, Jerry, the ducky. Should have taken a photo. Hey, Jerry. You get tired, don't you, Jerry? You get tired now. That's the other thing, she's getting tired a lot. I mean, I just thought that was old age and arthritis. Who knows? Who knows what these bloody things happen. So anyway, the doctor said the, uh, the ultrasound is pretty big. Like, I had a look at the pictures. I asked ChatGPT to summarise it for me. And it all comes back to, there's a growth there. <sighs> and what you've got to do is you've got to cut it out. But because it's so close to the ilium, or it is on the ilium, Il Ulysses, whatever the, I don't know, some Latin word, the orifice. Hey, Jerry, too many farts. You've been farting too much, Jerry. <laughs> um, they reckon it's uh, some, well, one, one doctor said, don't worry about it, it's too, she'll end up having diarrhea for like, too much it'll be too much on her she's old like she's 13 and but then they said you know i said look i'm going to go straight to the oncologist the specialist at sash not that fairfield's all right but these guys it's actually um they've booked me in to see dr michael uh that tv doctor 
Now I'm thinking from the from what you read on Dr. Google and it's all bullshit, but I think you could probably do it. It's just that um, her quality of life after it might be a bit shit. But then, like the doctor that did the ultrasound, the the other doctor, she said, you know, dogs like Jerry can live up to 13, uh, 15, 16. Hey, Jerry, hmm? even longer. And she's, uh, you, you know, you might as well, like, you know, if they can cut it out, but then they said it's in the, um, it, th there's a lymph node next to it as well that has bloody shit in it. Jerry, tippy tail. Huh? Tippy tail. And uh, I don't know what to do about Jerry. Jerry, you don't leave me. You don't leave me. I don't fucking bullshit. I don't know. You, you too many to decide this or decide that. <laughs> you almost got wet, Jerry. Hey, you almost got wet. <laughs> you know the one thing the doctor said, which surprised me was like Jerry doesn't know Jerry doesn't know oh, Jerry you, you don't know Jerry which is good I guess it's good Terry anyway Wednesday we're gonna go Wednesday and we're gonna talk to the dr. Michael and uh, I mean, if they can do it, they could do it last time. Just cut it out, and then just watch what she eats. Maybe you know, if it's if she's gonna have like a lot of diarrhea, just watch what she eats. Anyway, ah, oh, for fuck's sakes, Gary, look. You see the doggy, Jerry? Jerry, wait. Jerry, wait. Jerry, good girl, wait. Jerry, good girl. Always playing, huh? You're always playing, Jerry. Here. Come here, Jerry, look. <laughs> Jerry, you're always playing. Huh? Tippy tail. Anyway, what can you do? I've uh, come to here to take some photos and Jerry's always helping, so I've got my tripod I've got my filter, 10 stopper, 10 stopper Jerry. And you see these rocks here. Uh, and the water, hey Jerry, the water and the rocks will make it for a long exposure, blurry water. Jerry. <laughs> <laughs> he's smelling the camera and I, I'm gonna put the 12 to 40 Pro on the EM10 Mark II yes you can have Pro glass on consumer cameras <laughs> of course you can what's the difference and it's, it's actually not a bad it's actually not a bad fit the old uh, it's not too bad actually like originally when I got it, I just put it on the EM1 Mark II, but um, and I never put it on the EM10 Mark II. Uh, I was thinking it was too big, but it's actually not that bad. So anyway, we'll just take some photos. 
It should be alright. She's been through it before. Hey, Jerry. Uh, you've been through it before, Jerry. You're a fighter. Yes, you're a fighter. Hmm? Yes, you're a fighting girl. Hmm? You fight them all. You get the bad, bad medicine, Jerry. You get them. Hmm? Catch them, Jerry. Catch the sun. Yes, you're laughing, Bubby. You're always laughing. Hmm? You catch them, Jerry, and you, you hit that naughty cancer out. Mm. You're a good girl. We'll just cut it out. Huh? Cut it out, Jerry. We'll cut it out. And, uh, and then we'll just watch what we eat. Hey, Jerry. Yeah, we can just stay at home, Jerry. That's all. We don't have to go for big walks. We'll just stay at home if you get too tired. Hmm? You like the beach, don't you? Jerry loves the beach. I just put it on this rock. Put the uh, magnetic. Best thing to do is to use the back button focus, but I couldn't be bothered setting it up. Let me see if I can do it without, because once you put the magnetic filter on, the 10 stopper, it's going to be too dark and it probably won't focus. Then when you press the shutter button again, it focuses again, even after you've done it. So let's just see if I can focus anyway. Put put it on, and should be all right. Yeah, it focuses it anyway. Um, and I'll see if the shot turns out. It's a bit of fun. It's a bit of a fun day out, experimenting with Jerry and photography. There's lots of ways you can experiment with photography. The main thing really is, it's not really about anything but getting out. It's really what you gotta, it's one of the reasons why you probably get into the hobby in the first place. It gives you a good reason to get out there and you know, if you've got a dog, just to get out of the house and try something different. Just or you know, or the beauty of learning, a, a, you know, a, a new technology or you know an old technology really Jerry where are you going Jerry I mean if you know if it wasn't for Jerry I probably wouldn't even come out <laughs> I would but uh, it's just the added benefit of it you know you incorporate your hobbies and and Jerry's part of the, my life, so she comes with me. And learning photography has been like a blessing, really, ever since, you know, ever since it happened. Jerry, where did you go? Did you go say hello to the other doggy? Good girl. Hmm? You got the tippy tail now. You got the tippy tail. Mm, over there, tippy tail. Hey, I know you get tired, don't you? Poor Bubba. Poor Bum Bum. Jerry Bum Bum. Jerry Bum Bum. Yeah, uh, what happened? When I was about 35, my mum passed away, and uh, and my dad. I had to look after my dad, and my dad had a dog called Charlie, and Charlie uh, died around 2012. That was uh, horrific. So that was kind of like my dad's companion dog. And uh, and then, so I, I stayed with my dad because uh, he couldn't handle it by himself. So I just stuck around for a bit. 
And then when Charlie died, uh, we just thought, oh, no, we won't get another dog. It's too much pain. But then Jer <laughs> Jerry came. Huh? You're a twin, Jerry. Jerry was a twin. It was, uh, there were two there. One had a tail and one didn't. <laughs> Jerry, <laughs> the, the tippy tail. Hey, your sister didn't have a tail. I don't know why they do that. It's stupid. The tail's the best part, the tippy tail. Why would you take someone's tail off? Anyway, Jerry was an instant hit. Hey Jerry, instant hit with the family because you're the beautiful girl. I tell you what, uh, she she never has growled once, Jerry. Jerry, look, she's never growled. She's never been angry. Never. It's amazing. She's the most mild-tempered. Uh, little munchkin you know I've ever met hey Jerry you really are it's amazing how beautiful you are huh yes yeah it really is she's just a beautiful girl uh, never growled never bitten anyone never never raised her voice in anger nothing yeah, even when I teased her when she was young. <laughs> hey, Jerry, you remember? I used to tease you with the ball. Yeah, she's very kind-natured. It's, it's hard. It's just hard to imagine uh, a dog that's like that. It's just bizarre. It's really, it's amazing because she really is beautiful, uh, girl. Ah, so kind. Anyway, let's get back to this photo. Jerry, we take the photo? Yes, we take the photo. We always take the photo. All right, the camera's gone to sleep. No, it hasn't. All right, let's see, uh, 12 second delay, ISO 200. And Jerry, you wanna press the button? <laughs> All right, there we go. <laughs> Jerry by my side. You're taking the photos, Jerry. Uh, you're helping take the photos, Jerry. Uh, that's a photo in itself, Jerry, look. Mm. Hey, Jerry. That's a photo in itself, Jerry. Hey, mm. you're concentrating. You're concentrating on the bird, Jerry. There's a photo there. Jerry, the photographer. Why you schmackaroo? Huh, you have a scratch on the bum, Jerry. You see the birdie? Go catch him, Jerry. Catch him. Jerry, catch him. Go get him. I don't think we're allowed on the beach. <laughs> there were signs everywhere saying not allowed on the beach. This is uh, Lady Robinson's beach. For some reason I thought it was a nudist beach, but I think that's somewhere else. Lady Robinson near San Susi uh, in Dolls Point. It's nice here, it's nice here, it's not too busy. It's, uh, they're doing construction shit everywhere, but I think this uh, long exposure has had its uh, time. It's a bit boring. Let's go for a photo walk instead. There's the good old EM10 video mode. Hey Jerry. Mm? Come on. Let's go vlog. I know that there's a finite time that dogs have on this earth, which is their unconditional love. And I think God played a trick on that. I think God played a trick on them. when they only gave him a short lifespan. I think he's got to be positive. Hey Jerry, you 
got to be positive, Jerry, and not um, not try and dwell on it too much. It's part of life, I guess. So just trying to come to grips with it. Good because from what I can see, they could probably you know, do something. The old doctor. Hey Jerry. Yeah, they're pretty good these days. You're uh you gotta have you gotta have positive thoughts. Alright Jerry. Alright uh, Thanks for watching. I'll uh I'll catch you on the next one anyway. I'll keep you updated. I probably won't do many much photography, but I'll keep you updated. Gary, watch this. Gary, watch this. <laughs> Someone lost their Polaroids. Jerry, someone lost their Polaroids. That'll make a good photo, actually. It's got sticky on there. Someone's memories, Jerry, lost. I think someone had a bit of a a suki or something and they threw them away maybe I don't know maybe I put something in the, like that like that what do you think Jerry? we'll take a photo maybe they lost it maybe they threw it away sometimes the memories are just too painful Jerry Gary, I love you. This way.